Here's a pair of Sennheiser Momentum 4 wireless headphones. I'm going to show you how to pair and connect this directly to your Samsung TV. So the first thing you want to do is go to the settings on your Samsung TV. So what you want to do is click on the home button. And then when you click the home button, you, you should see all these apps down here. What you want to do is just move over to the left, keep going left. See those three um, horizontal lines all the way on the left right there left again and now you see the settings the gear icon so go left left right there settings click on ok on the remotes and now from here once you're here you just want to go down to sound right there now we're going to move over to the right or you can click on enter now it says sound output is going out of my tv speaker and then we're going to change that to go to these headphones here so let's go ahead and click on ok on sound output now we go down to Bluetooth speaker list right there. Click on OK on the remote. Now it's searching, okay? Whatever is in pairing mode, okay? So now we got to put these in pairing mode. So let's go ahead and uh, put this in pairing mode. Um, this, these are on right now. Let me turn these off first. Okay, so I just turned it off, and now I'm going to put it in pairing mode. Press and hold this, this button here until all the lights here starts blinking, okay? Ready, set, go. Press and hold. Just keep on holding. Just wait. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Oh, there it is. All the lights are bl it's bl blinking now. And now we should, okay, there it is right there. Momentum four. You can see it showing up at the bottom down there. So let's go down. Needs pairing. Click on okay. You can see all the lights still moving here. Pair and connect. Okay, it is now connected. It just said it in here. She just said it's connected. Lights are no longer on. You can see that we're connected right there. And there we go. So now I can watch my Netflix or my YouTube and the audio will come out of here. All right. Uh, really quickly, if you guys have trouble issues uh, connecting or pairing, you can just do a factory reset on these. Okay. Look in the description below. I showed how to factory reset these. All right. Good luck, guys.